now. So now, let me explain. Let me explain Torah and Injil. Let me explain Torah and Injil according to Quran. Wait, wait, wait. Injil. Don't ever say that. Go on, let it go. Let me You're let me stupid, Muhammad. So, wait, wait. Okay, let me respond. Let me respond. So, no. so now. So now, wait, wait, wait. First prophet wait, wait. in Torah, Zabur, and Indeed. Wow. Wait. Yes. So now, let me, let me describe Torah and Injil. Torah and Injil, the followers of Torah and Injil, according to Quran, were Muslims. Yes. Quran, chapter 5, chapter 5, chapter 3, come on. verse come on, come on. 52. The disciples of Jesus were Muslims. Tell him, brother. Brother, please. Jesus. Let me finish. Quran, please tell us. Prophet cannot be mentioned in the Bible. Cannot be mentioned. You want to discuss so, the Bible? You want to talk? So friend, you, want, you want to talk to so me? Friend, if any Muslim, I remember I talked to you. Any Muslim, I remember I talked to you before. Bible I remember you. I remember you. He is throwing his Quran so now, under the bus. So now, listen. He is throwing Let me finish. Under the okay. Bus. okay. Let me finish. Quran, Allah told us, Injil and Torah, both of them were corrupted. Were corrupted. We are not saying, we are not saying the whole Bible is corrupted. The Torah, that now they claim, the one they have having now, is got some verses from God. We allow that. But the New Testament has got nothing to do with God. That is a clear because New Testament there's no Muslim. single verse where God of the Bible Muslims speaks. Making this false the Old Testament the sometimes you find out God of the Bible is speaking, Muslim despite it's corrupted. Jeremiah chapter 8, verse 8. Quran also tells us the Bible, the Torah Good is corrupted. Quran chapter 2, verse 97. Quran chapter 3, verse 78. Also, the Torah in Jin is corrupted. The Allah said, Quran chapter 5, verse 13 to 15. Chapter 5, verse 17, verse 19. Chapter 5, verse 40 to 41. We know all that tells us, Allah told us, those books were corrupted. Christians always say, Muslims, they cherry pick the Bible, they choose the verse that suits them, and the verse that doesn't suit them, they don't choose it. Same Christians choose and cherry pick the verses of the Bible. Example, Matthew chapter 17, verse 21. Matthew chapter 18, verse 11. Matthew chapter 20 and 20, verse 16. Matthew chapter 23, verse 14. Matthew, Mark, chapter 7, verse 16. Mark, chapter 9, verse 46, verse 49. Va and verse 46, verse 49, or verse 44, and Mark chapter 11, verse 30, 26, Mark chapter 15, verse 20, 28, the Gospel of Luke chapter 17, verse 36, the Gospel of Luke chapter 23, verse 17, the Gospel of John, 1 John 5, 7, John 5, 4, 1 Acts, the book of Acts, Chapter and um, chapter eight, verse thirty-seven, thirty-seven. Acts chapter fifteen, verse thirty-four. Acts chapter twenty-four, verse one, and ch chapter seven, chapter uh, twenty-four, verse seven. Acts chapter twenty-four, I mean twenty-eight, verse twenty-nine. Romans chapter sixteen, verse twenty-four. All these verses, Christians disagree. They choose and cherry pick whichever verse they want to. The Torah again is corrupted. The, and the book of Numbers, chapter 21, verse 14. Number and 
Joshua, but, uh, the book of the word of Lord is missing from Torah, Old Testament. And, the God, and, and Joshua, chapter 10, verse 13, the book of Joshua is missing from Old Testament. And the book of 1 Kings, and the book of the Acts of Solomon, chapter 1, and 1 Kings, 1 Kings, what's happening? What's happening? Wait, 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 wait. One Kings chapter, listen, one Kings chapter 11 verse 41. The book of the God of the, uh, the God of Seal, the book of Samuel the Seal, the book of Nathan the prophet, one Chronicles chapter 20, 29 verse 29. The book of Shemaiah, the book of Shemaiah, the two Chronicles chapter 12 verse um, 15 is missing also the book of Jeho, Jeho uh, the two chronicles chapter chapter um, chapter 20 verse 34 all these books are missing from New Testament Christians if your God is all-powerful why he didn't look after your books therefore your God is not powerful you try to say Muslims God is not powerful because he failed to look after the and gospel and the Torah and Injil. Same question. Allah did not promise to look after Torah and Injil, but he promised to look after what? Quran chapter 15 verse 9. Also, he did not promise to look after the Torah previous books. Quran chapter 5 verse 44. Wassalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. Do you want to talk to him? Do you want to talk to him? No, I did talk to him, you remember? Okay. It's about the one and should I just tell everything? Yeah. Thank you. Okay. If you say you finish, done, then done. No one can prove. They use they use the Quran and they can't describe the Torah and Jin according to Quran. <laughs> Let's go, let's go.